Good day guys, tonight I will talk about a horror movie by the name of, what is it, um, oh yeah, Ed Jean, the portal of Pinefield, which has one time of Donald Miller, crime drama, here, um, which, has, which is the director of, and written by Michael Fifo. FIFO or F-E-I-F-E-R You know I have I um, hope I pronounce the name correct and the guy to really focus on is Kane Hodder at, at Jean Adrian Frantz at Erica Michael Berman at Jack and Sean Hoffman at Bobby Manson. The plot of this film is basically this um, a twisted and murderous appetite of a neutral as a gene who took his small town of Pinefield to come acquire a shock to his neighbors, especially Jupiter Manson, whose mother Vera and Govan have gone missing. Well, um, in case no one's never seen it, I'm going to check it out and this time it will be a just brief review. Like I mentioned, pros and cons, I mentioned that this is basically based on a serial killer by the name of Ed Jean. So, a time of pros, um, this movie has gruesome imagery. I mean, the kills are not really gruesome. But what it does to eviction they actually quite gruesome. The cast they actually find one can hold her like that gene there like it's a good job. I go like the cast. I mean with nine minutes run time this movie I found it was like too short. I found this movie couldn't be a lot longer. And the kill actually could have been shown. What makes this what makes this gruesome is skins people and skin his body part of what he skin hung up. I thought it's gonna be like a texture change on mask type of movie, but um not really um not what I expected. I mean, it does capture people. You mentioned there in the movie they killed 10 people, in which he got, he got a trial by two, in which he was put in jail and judged for only two people with no parole. I mean, this the, kill, the crime that happened back in 1957, which the movie mentioned. So the movie got an interesting premises of a serial killer who kills people and this guy is known to people but when they found out the top of the person was at the end of the movie where they go to his place, go into his house and discover the top of the person is, they want to they want to get really want to get into more because he's quite a psychopath. What a, you know, even certain words they use, this guy is just one sick bastard. That was the strongest word they use in the whole movie. And this movie has no, really no profanity, no sex, no, nothing really. But the imagery in this movie might, might get upset people. Particularly if they lose people. He's locked. You know, people love because the movie, you know, Bobby Manson discovered his mother was killed, and that might upset some people. Cons, this is not the movie some people would expect. I mean, it's supposed to be based on a serial kill. To really, really no kill. I mean, you see him cut people up, but it's just. 
the Greek imagery they took part in my Mag Pills Grimmy. And at one time I thought it could have been longer. But I have to get for my review for this movie Dice and Nerd Kindness. Would I recommend it? Why you be like a cane holder and I found he's the star of this movie. He does like what his best way was given, but it could be a heck of a lot better. Look at men, like I mentioned, you like a can order movie. I think it might be worth a watch, even serial killers. I just don't expect, don't expect a lot. And expect to be, you know, expect to form a cane holder. I mean, it's been a lot of butcher type of movies. We, you know, ran back killing people. He does kill people, but most of it is seen off screen. It's just the imagery afterward he does to people mark my people think, wow. But um, for a Silica movie, this is not really what I expected. Score? 5 or 10, and this is not what I expected. I expect a lot more, I expect to kill, not just gritty imagery. I mean, you see people get cut up, you know, but it's not really, not, 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 not the best seal kill I've ever seen. And not the best I've, I've seen from King, King Hoda. I've seen it a lot better, so this is a 5 out of 10 for me. Oh, uh, anyone might have seen, um, had um Jean, the butcher of what's it sorry, um of Pinefield. I would really like to hear thoughts. Um you think that this movie really had a had a had a had what it could have been or could have been a lot better? Or do you think this movie was right? I always think this movie could have been a lot more grisly and more wrong. I think did not find this movie wrong. So I like, I like to hear thoughts in this movie. Well, anyone who might have stumbled across my review for the first time, you know, give me a like and subscribe to my channel. Until later on, I wish everyone to take care, keep safe, and bye for now. Peace.